PA Prince. He's very active in 4-H. He's the third vice president of the Liberty Hill 4-H Circle. Now this is the part I really enjoy. He also runs a YouTube page called the KB Kid Channel. And uh, he actually does a great job on that. Sometimes he gets guys that he interviews, like me, that are kind of dull, you know, and just can't <laughs> seem to get with it. But he gets, some, he gets some real great people on there too. So he's gonna be speaking speaking this evening, and I want to make sure I quote exactly what the topic is, how to judge a own American. Go ahead, Luke. All right, as Kenny said, Ed, I'm going to talk to you about how to judge a American rock. Now, some of y'all from up north don't see growth much, and this is why I want to talk to you, since some of the judges around here will are going to be showing growth. This KB right here is my first KB. His name was Sink, also known as Simply Spritzer. And the reason why I wanted to show him to you, to all of y'all, is because he is a very great KB. He has, has a longer head, head that, you know, that might be going through your head. But, but he has a nice height. He, was, he has a great bony. There isn't much place by putting on him. him, and he was a very handsome pig. Um, you had the privilege of the judges here. <laughs> <laughs> so, um, I'm going to tell you all, um, in the standards of perfection, the points of a Roman are under set bullets and a group. And as you can see, he type is worth 25 points. But I'm going to tell you right now, we're not going to be talking about type type much in this speech. Each, but the Rome's uh, description, yeah. and you may say, are is on page 251. Now, oh, you might be asking, what is a Rome? Well, a Rome is a mixture of two or more colors. Colors blended with what? Height. So you might have a tri a black roan, or red roan, or real roan. And which way every roan has the same thing in common. It's one or two colors mixed with white. So it's like a, so we took a solid, uh, say uh, red, and they just took a marker and just scratched scratch all over the, the roan. should have even room. In other words, earth, there should be a nice mixture of roaming, playing, for example. So we got this fresh out the, the description of room. A great base, base color with even distribution of roaming, running is the most important thing of judging a room. And that is true. true because if you want a nice even mixing, that's what you're looking for. The, the most points that you're wanting to look for are in the roni and the base color as well as the top. And some of you are asking, why are you talking about how base color? Well, base color, or, or for example, let's say red. And it's worth just 15 points. And if you're showing you're reading your own base colors are on half your, your bar. Alright? Alright? And also, but when you read the red to, to the base, to the red, the red one, you will get either a red and not, or maybe both. Both? But I, you want to show oh, that, um, show both. Right? then you might be able to win in, <coughs> in the red and the red one. Right? Okay, I'm just going to say this off the bat. Rones come in every color. Oh, you might imagine, except for white. <laughs> we, 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 there's the most common red one from here in Texas, 
in the unusual for me cream color. Since, so yeah, they come in all sorts of colors, from cells, solids to goodness. For a trigrome, you must have an even mixture of three colors. Sometimes the most common one you might see are black, red, and you know, and black. Mix into one painting. Let's take a him for example. Now, some of y'all say, well, yes, <laughs> he might. I have a little mark on his face. That's okay. It's all right if you have that marking on his face. It's also known as a split face. This left kidney, as you may see, has a splotches. It's why Hadi on his ear and a half band near his shoulders, while the other one has um, a nice even in front. All right? But you don't think, okay, by show of hands, who thinks that these are just some? Um, a Rome TSW by show of hands. Tell me. None of y'all? Good. Since <laughs> tri Rome's aren't prone to TSWs. <laughs> Brindles. Brindles. They're prone to Brindles. Okay. Now, bolts are. Now, bolts on a Rome are, are um, self solid or goody hatches. But on tri Rome's and all the other Rome's, you might see a band. That's also a fault. Not a disqualification. What is not a fault is a coloration on a toe, on toenails. You might see the kid has a white foot and the kid has a red toe. It's all right. right? And also, it's all right if you have, have a blaze going down your face. Okay? But what the disqualification is, less than 75% of the body is being wrong. And as well as clear cut Dalmatian spots over 20% of the body, with the, which does not resemble wrong. But you also want to make sure to check those spots to see if there's white hair, since it might be just a darkly grown patch. Now here we have a few examples of poor wrong. On the left, this uh, this road has white road. When I mean light, I mean, mean not much road. I mean, mean more white than black. Half for this case. Um, on the top right is white spots. Yes, she has has a white spot on her head. Head and but overall, she is a nice nice road. On the bottom left, uh, this one has a light spot, but the roaning starts more towards her hips, but you want the roaning to be all out on her body. Body, for example. And um, this one, and right here, this, the bottom right, tri -rome. This tri is uh, very splotchy, as you may see. It, now, here's a few more. Or, uh, Rones. The black Ron right here, um, he has a few spots. His belly's a bit spotted. Then the top red Ron. On, on as you see, um, the Roning is darker towards the front and it gets much, it gets to the nice even Roning towards the back. Back as well. Oh, and the trirone has a band around his midsection, but the chocolate, it has grizzly hairs. Yes, as you may know, it's like not wrong. Now, this is the example of my group of a great room. As you can see, he might have an elongated head or a darted head, as some of y'all may call it, but he has a nice, even runny, nice, loose. Not too much spot touchiness. He has nice even running on the top, top sides, and on the belt, as you may see. See? Because you want that in your lines. You want that always in your lines. 
Now, this one kind of is to show you why I love phones. I love phones because you get surprises of different colors. Um, that cream I said I had actually came out of my black rolls. So yes, rolls show you unexpected turns and twists. Now, any questions? Yes. If you have a roll that has bands, how do you improve that? Reading, reading, that's basically the best answer. And, yes. and praying. <laughs> yes, as my mother said, pray and pray, read and pray. Any other questions? Uh, yes, ma'am. Uh, any comments on rows and long hair? Uh, <laughs> I'm not much. You can say pass. I'm, I'm not much for growing on long hairs. Uh, yes, ma'am. What if a rum has white feet, brown or black above it, and they're burning on the body? Uh, it's all right. As long as it doesn't, as long as, so in our, in our barn, we will keep them as long as it's just the toes. Yes. If it's going above just the foot, they don't stay. And they never make it to the show table. So yeah, those are like pet things that we sell off to the friends. We don't usually see it. We don't usually. <laughs> <laughs> we don't usually see it much above the toes. Any other questions? No. I have a question about breeding them. So, if you breed a roan with good distribution uh, running to another roan with good distribution, do you get good roans out of them? Well, it's a human. So you may get roans, and you may get reds, but you also get a lethal. A lethal is a white, a run on roan. White can be that has a lot of disability. Sometimes you may very rarely get a very good one that you may be able to show. Oh, I actually had that happen to me. <laughs> you must be like, what is this? So. It's a little bit like breeding uh, brokens. So sometimes we'll breed great roans to great roans, brought lines, and, and you don't always get great roaning. Um, so it's, it's a little bit like that, that breeding of the brokens. It's a bit of a the roll of the dice sometimes. Yes. It does help. We do breed great roans into our great roan lines, and it does help improve the roaning. Um, but you're still going to get those funky ones that come out with white spots behind their ears that shouldn't be there, or other odd things. Thank you, sir. Uh, on the uh, lethal roans, if you get one that lives, yes. they're always going to throw you around. Great. If it lives and gets to breeding age and will breed for you, you can pretty much make any color roan you want, and that's a true roan. Yes, yes, yes. And if we made, like Double I said, roans. we made green roans out of it. Uh, we had a style one time that had six litters. She's probably one of the best mothers we ever had, but it's very, very rare. And we've had boars that yep. have lived and made babies for us, too. Yes, so. But you can never breed two lethals together because they'll all, all be lethals and they'll yes. probably die. Yes, I'm just curious if your barn, have you seen any changes of roaning on their babies with their adults? Mm -hmm. Well, yes. Um, basically, sometimes you may grizzled roan, but that grizzle might grow off over time and you might get a beautiful roan. Uh, so this baby right here that I'm holding, putting in that picture, the one on the left, no, the right and left, they were, they weren't that good, but after a while they were beautiful. Some, the one on the left actually won me a few best We see them change in darkness to lightness. They're born a little darker, and then they lighten as they get, as they sometimes age. Sometimes, or or it gets, or sometimes it gets spottier. Sometimes the roaning comes in better. So, yeah. so yeah. you kind of have to wait for that adult yeah. coat to come through. So yeah, it's like a roll of dice, and you might get this. Yes, yes ma'am. Grizzly. And they're lightly red. How is grizzly darker? Grizzly is yeah, a white. And and also when they put it lightly red. Yes. Yes. We see it mostly in our chocolates. Yeah. 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 Yeah.